Guys, we're finally doing it. We are going to the Goodwill bins. I bring a sexy back while I break the back. Smoke an ounce every day, I have a heart attack. I'm gonna play a little bass so I don't get attached. I'm a smooth criminal like Michael Jack. So basically, my friend Manny hit me up. I met him through the Illinois Vintage Fest, actually. He just like came up to my booth, I think the first one I did, and we just became homies ever since. And yeah, so he lives pretty close to the Goodwill bins. So I'm heading over to his place right now, and then we're gonna carpool over there. The closest Goodwill bins that I know of is in Indiana. We have like an hour drive ahead of us right now. But honestly, since it's like my first time going, I'm pretty excited. I don't really know what to expect. I've seen a lot of different things about the bins online. You line up and then everyone charges at it when they tell you to go. Um, some people wear gloves. I don't fuck with all that shit. I'm just gonna get in there, get dirty, find some heat today. Let's get after it. And hopefully when I see Manny, we'll record some stuff together and I'll kind of document how the whole process goes for me for my first time so you guys can see. What's good, homie? Quick Dunkin' stop before we go. Let's get it. All right, we made it. You ready? Yes, sir, ready for the first day at the bins? Let's go, it's my first day. I don't know what to expect. He told me all the methods to find the clothes. He's got the sauce. <laughs> About to run up the first new rotation. Here we go. I already grabbed some stuff from some old bins. I don't even know if I'm gonna grab any of this stuff, but I just threw it in here. But yeah, here we go. That shit is crazy, bro. They just brought this out and they just they just go crazy in there, man. What the fuck? All right, so we just chilling right now. Yup. I got a rack of some bullshit. I'll show you guys right now. Some random ass ASICs. Half this shit in here, I'm probably not even gonna get. I'm like, I don't know what to look for is my problem. Since it's like my first time in this bitch, like I don't know like what's good, what's bad in terms of like finding shit at the bins. I mean, obviously I know what to look for like in terms of vintage, but I don't know. It's just a lot of shit in there, but got some Levi's. I think they're my size. Some Jordan sweats. They, yeah, I, Thought this jacket was kind of cool. It's also falling apart, so I'm gonna probably put that back. See, like, I'm just grabbing random shit, man. Like, what the fuck is this? <laughs> they just kind of sick. <laughs> random jean jacket type thing. We got the Tinkerbell zip. That was actually kind of cool. And one sweats. Fire. Um, I got some blankets in here because my homie might want those. Got some records, might put these on the wall. There's like a little vintage crew with some bullshit on there. I just like the green. And then a little Nautica fleece. It's got a little stain on it, so might have to, if I'm gonna get out, I have to get that out. But I fuck with it. I actually got some patches on the side. Cool color. And then a Pepsi cup. <laughs> so I got a bunch of bullshit. We'll see if I end up getting any of this, but we're waiting for the next clothes rotation right now. Hopefully it'll come out soon. But uh, yeah, these people are crazy in here. I, I, ain't, I ain't built for this. <laughs> yeah? What are you doing here? I just flew down here to the mall. Okay. All right, so we got a mess of things right now. Got a bunch of blankets. My homie might use these to make some cut and sew shit. I got some Jordans right here. They beat as fuck. They're my size though, so I might keep them just to like beat them even more. A bunch of shit, but I'm probably gonna walk away with like three things. <laughs> hey, you wanna be in the video at all or not? Nah? That yeah. Like yeah, that's how I do all my videos. And then also this dude right here, he came up to me, he said what's up. He said he's seen my videos before. It's nice to meet you, bro. Appreciate you, dog. He's from Atlanta, so that's kind of crazy. Like just the fact that he seen my shit, but yeah. Let's dive in here, see what I got. All right, we got a little Pokemon tee. It's new school. I don't know if I'm gonna get it. Georgia hoodie, it's not bad. Like the way this thing goes, bro, you just grab everything and then I'm gonna put back half this shit, man. Indiana hoodie. One of my better finds, this Reebok windbreaker. That's nice. I like the, the Charlotte Hornet colorway. Buddy from Atlanta actually gave me this one right here, a little Michigan State hoodie. Fire. Got a classic Levi sports tag right here. Nice little sweater. See, it's all by the pound here, so things that can get pretty expensive. Got a little Bucks crew neck. Then we got whatever, Simpsons tea, not bad. Got some Simpson toys, 
got this is probably one of my other favorite finds michael jordan playground on vhs this is sick as fuck another vhs mlb got the little palkia dude grabbing that for sure nice little button up right here i actually like the colors on that that's pretty sweet kentucky shirt right here dude i got so there's so much shit in this card damn all right we got some white tag 90s nike soccer shorts with my number on them that's fire little bmw polo got another button up right here with some embroidery on it cool we got toby big dog daddy front and back nice manny sauce me this one patriots football little crew neck okay found this one indianapolis colts man this is taking forever holy shit there's so much stuff in this car i didn't even realize oh i really like this piece actually this croatia one is so fire on that haynes ultimate cotton tag got a little world of warcraft shirt right here some more oh this is a jacket i was gonna say i thought this was a blanket but this is a jacket this jacket is tough grabbing that for sure got some shit right here toby keith little car t got these more blankets so this peanuts one this fuck this peanuts one is actually so fire i think my homie's gonna take it from me because he does the cut and so shit that kind of wraps it up i think we're gonna go maybe to an antique mall or we might be done for the day but yeah that wraps it up google bins first time ever here it's a decent experience a lot of the people said that it was pretty shit today so i mean it is what it is i got a bunch of shit i'll let you guys know at home what i end up getting psych blue eyes white dragon bro what the fuck and this is the only harley uh this is my brother phone uh -huh. like i said it's um uh, super sick. yeah oh damn yeah, that's a nice back hit yeah, yeah. yeah. And some wrestling tees. Just that one. Yeah, yeah nice, yeah. man. Fuck yeah. You got a shop or anything? You want to shout it out? Oh, uh, um, I, I sell on whatnot. Okay, there, yeah, me too, bro. Uh, Fuck yeah. Hell yeah. Were you at the Illinois Vintage Fest or nah? This nah, past weekend? I'm in, I'm in uh, South Bend by got Notre you. Dame. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Got yeah, you, got yeah, you. Yeah. That's dope. Say say the name. Uh, Dennis102497 right. and whatnot. Got you, bro. Yo. Appreciate it, man. Yo. Check them out. I guess we stand for one more uh, rotation, so here we go. All right, so I ended up grabbing like two more things. Manny gave me this Carhartt, and that pretty much wraps up the day. Uh, left those behind. Let's go see how much it's gonna cost. <laughs> All right, so we just hopped out of there. Yes, sir. Pretty good day, I guess. He got some fucking sick ass Power Rangers action figure. That thing is dope. Um, and like two other tees, right? Yeah. Yeah, so it was a good day. I have a fucking bag full of shit, man. Like I got like 40 things and funny, thing is i sold three of those blankets already 10 bucks like a pop so i only spent 38 bucks so i basically my trip was paid for eight dollars for literally all that shit it that's crazy but a lot of people there were saying that uh it was like a slow day they didn't find too much today like you yeah, usually you I, say agree. I would agree yeah it's usually like way better you find some at least something decent you know and most of the stuff i found was like okay you know i'll sell it for maybe 10 to 20 dollars at most but I don't know what the fuck's going on around here right now. There's like 40 cops. What the fuck? Flip the camera and show What's going on? Is there an accident right now? Yeah, there's like, yeah, there is. There's like four cops. Some shit's going on right now. But uh, our plan for the rest of the day, I think we're going to hit this antique mall that he says is pretty sick. And then we might stop into like a village on the way home. Uh, I got a game at 830, so we're going to try to fit this all in and make it happen. But uh, yeah, honestly, a great day. Loved hanging out with Manny. He's the boy. And like, it's just insane that like we met through the vintage festivals. So like, it's just really cool. You know, you go to these events, you meet people, you have fun and you sell shit. And it's just like a good time. So if you guys haven't gone, you need to go and you can meet people like Manny. He's a good guy. Straight up connections, man. <laughs> That's right. I've met so many connections. Uh, I'll get some footage at the antique mall and maybe a village. So that's a little update for y'all. All right. So this is the antique mall. I'm interested. I have no idea what I'm walking into right now, but straight up gas okay okay that's right let's find out we got all types of shit in here what the hell crazy this is crazy all right to end the day hitting the village apparently this is his favorite one this is the spot there you go let's go all right, quick little trip. This doesn't have a price on it, which is crazy. It's got the tag though. Then we got this tee right here. Fox Chicago, fire. Manny gave this to me, he doesn't want it. Dude doesn't buy anything. I don't know what's wrong with him. 
this guy's shirt's actually sick. I like the green with the red is tough. They're asking eight bucks on it though. Nice little back hit too. I'm grumpy, not bad. Carhartt jacket, like this actually. And then I really fuck with this jersey, man. Like that neck on this is so tough. The front sucks though. Nice little number 12 though. Got Bulls tee, little Delta tag, four bucks. Grabbing that. Little Levi's piece right here. I like that embroidery. Found a little Harley plate and a little shiny Mickey Mouse. Okay, and the absolute last thing of the day, a little Pokemon book. It is a Pathway to Adventures. It's got a little story in here. I have to grab that. Put this on my table. Okay, I'm a liar, dude. He had to find this as we were leaving, bro. It's always me, full man. bin, full of just these insane fucking comics, dude. All of these Dragon Ball Zs have fucking posters in them. Show them, show them one. Yeah, like, oh my God, bro. Those up. are gonna be insane. What the fuck? <laughs> what a steal, dude. 370 each, not bad. And then I also found these on the shelf right here. So I'm gonna grab both of those and then grab a few of these. I have to, man, like that's that's sick. Did we just spend damn near $100 on some comic books? Yes, we did. Yeah, we did. <laughs> Bro, they all had fucking posters in them. Every single one, Dragon Ball Z posters, like they were insane. They were pretty good. So. And we sat there for like 30 minutes looking at all of them. And that was pretty hype. Like, look at the back of this car right now. What? It's insane what we did. Crazy. <laughs> All right, so this is everything that I ended up getting from the Goodwill bins. Honestly, very decent trip for me personally. It's going to help me restock after my last event that I did. Uh, some of my favorite things are like these 90s white tag Nike shorts. This Reebok windbreaker is crazy. Tinkerbell zip up. The Jordan VHS goes crazy. Palkia toys dope. Simpsons characters are crazy. Bart looks high as hell in this, bro. Shit's so funny. And then this is the rest of the stuff I got from that village discount that we went to. I got this cool ass Harley license plate. I got a dope vintage guest shirt, a shiny Mickey Mouse. And then I got all these comic books. Insane, bro. The Pikachu one was just sick. This is the first one I saw. I was like, okay, I gotta grab that. Then Manny found a whole bucket full of these Dragon Ball Z and some Marvel comics in there as well. This is my favorite one, bro. It's like a mug shot of trunks. So tough. On the day, I ended up spending 36 there, like 50 here and 40 there. So damn near like 130 minus the 30 that I made in profit from those blankets. So like 100 bucks for all of this shit. Honestly, I can't even complain. That's a good haul. It was a great day. Let's go back to Manny and see what's up. All right, so we're wrapping up the day. It was honestly a great day. Manny showed me the ropes today in the bins. Showed me a dope village discount. Got some stuff there. Showed me that awesome antique mall. I had no idea about that. And this is all in Indiana. Like, the fuck's in Indiana? Little baby Indy. <laughs> yeah, so we want to start making like some videos together and shit. So we have like a little challenge idea that we kind of want to do. So if we get 50 likes on this video, we're going to do a thrifting challenge. Who can make the best fit with like a certain amount of money? Oh, this guy's lying, bro. Since you guys saw what I bought, y'all know I get the heat, man. And all he got, all he got was this Power Ranger thing. Are you kidding still me? Winning, bro. He might win. I don't know. But yeah, so we want to make that video. Definitely like this video. Subscribe. Check out his channel as well. It's going to be in the top of the description. Yes, sir. That's pretty much it. Comment your favorite thing from today's video. Overall, the bins. I give it a thumbs up, man. That shit was fun. It was cool. It was an experience for sure. Met some people that have seen my shit before. That also happened at Village. I, I don't know if I mentioned that yet, but some dude also came up to me at Village in Indiana, said, I've seen your shit. It's just, it's just cool, man. So me and Manny are uh, gonna chop it up real quick. And then that's the end of the video. Appreciate you guys if you watched this whole thing and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.